Hello, welcome back to Adventures of Well I'm Me, and today we're going to be playing Diddy Kong Racing for our Museum of Gaming A to Z for the Nintendo 64. I'm looking forward to this. We're going to jump straight into it, then we'll play for a little bit. 10 minutes, 15 minutes, I don't know. We'll do, do a couple races. Uh, give it a rating of 10, give it an honest opinion, all that jazz, and I really need to sneeze. I can just feel it. I, it's right here. I just I need to sneeze. Oh, and it's not going to go away either. Ooh. Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> Alright, and we are going to pick Banjo because we absolutely love Banjo. Let's just do A A A. Yeah, so this is a really cool racing game that features uh Diddy Kong and some other rare rare title characters. So you got Conker, you got Banjo. Um I'm not sure about all the characters where they come from. I think it's some made for this, some kind of made in uh other games. Not too sure. Anyways. <laughs> Essentially we're gonna be racing. Um pretty awesome game. I nearly have a hundred percent on my um actual save file. But I am the genie of the island. I'm here to help you. Um but yeah, it's it's really hard to get everything in the game. Um, if you if you want to see exactly what's like exactly what you need, go check out uh, the completionist for this because it's insane the amount of uh, different uh, things you have to do to get complete this game 100%. Whoa. Rolls are difficult, by the way. Here we go. So let's go into some races. So essentially, you go around and you've got all these different things that you can do. You get different races there. Um, you get your time attack. I think that's a trophy case for when you do complete different things. And you've got to have balloons for each of these other sections to get. Uh, progress. I think that's a secret. So there's heaps in this game. But let's go racing Ancient League. I won't be doing a lot of the races, I'm just going to be showing you kind of the one race and then seeing how long that takes depends on if we can fit others in. Because I don't know how long it's going to be. Um, but, yeah. Oh, it would just be one of those games where I don't want to say exactly how long we're going to spend on it because I could say something and then it could be completely wrong. Now, I believe bananas make you go faster in uh, this game. I believe. Oh, that key. Ooh, we need to get that key and win the race. So you can build up your uh, balloon bonuses as well if you're better than I am and can actually hit the stupid balloons that you should be. Alright, I need to get that key is it still here. Good, alright. Oh, what? That did not work. I've now I've completely lost. Pretty sure you have to come in first place to use the key. Yeah, that did not work too well. Alright, so the races aren't gonna go for too long, which is alright. Let's try again. We've gotta get that key. See how maybe we could get the key at the start. 
and then come back from that. No, the key's gone. Maybe it can't be on the first lap. I don't remember seeing it there on the first lap, I saw it on the second lap though. This is a um, hard game to control. It's not easy like most racing games. Or not saying that all oh, racing games are easy, it's just not as easy as a lot of racing games. That's probably a better way to say that. So I power this one up to the maximum. Here we go. Look at that. There you go. Just gives you a faster boost, essentially. I think that key actually did stay with us after all that. Alright. Surely we can get first place now. This game is a lot harder than I remember it being. Like, those controls are really hard. And we have a balloon. So essentially you've got to collect all the balloons on the island to win the game. Uh, the balloons give you different... Oh, that's the key. The balloons give you different um, stages unlocked. Unlock different stages for you, that's what I'm trying to say. Um, and then, with that, the, um, so you can unlock different areas. So as you can see, there's five levels in this, so I've got two balloons now. And we've also got this secret area, so let's go check this one out. First player to hatch three eggs will win. Hatch or catch? That did not work. What? I don't I don't know. I'm not really good at this game anymore. I apparently used to be a lot better than I am now. Yeah, I'm not too sure. How I've gone from being like pretty decent at this game to being rather terrible. Oh, my second egg's gone. So this is like my cheat's way. Ah, oh, I got in fourth place. <laughs> That's how I used to play. I used to sit down there. Um, I used to play with my brother. Ah, um, uh, I'm not gonna be, be done too well at this. Um, it is a lot more difficult than I remember. That is interesting. Um, let's go do Fossil Canyon. We'll do another race. Um, that'll take us to about 10 minutes, so. Be alright. I mean, this is a good game, but I want to say it's definitely not, in my mind, as good as Mario Kart. Um, I think Mario Kart will always just have that kind of uh, party racing game um, style down pat. Now, although this is fun, it's just... It's 
feel as though it does lack a little bit compared to the Mario Kart franchise. Which... I feel as though this is the game that's supposed to compete with Mario Kart at the time. And it just hasn't cut it. Oh no. Oh no. This hasn't worked out. Oh, he's, he's, he's trying to oil me. He's trying to oil me. Oh, that was good. Come on. We're winning. We're winning. It is. A, yeah, this is a fun game. Just yeah. I just think yeah, Mario Kart will always be that one kind of party, the party kart racer. It's just yeah. It just still doesn't have it for me, which is sad. I'd love it if this game um, brought back more good memories. <laughs> there we go. Well, came in first. That's not too bad. Anyway, I'm gonna be wrapping this up here. Let's just get that balloon. That's uh, about 12 minutes of gameplay, which is not too bad. Um, yeah, um, out of 10, I'd give this 7 out of 10. Um, the controls are difficult, and I do remember them being a little bit difficult. Not as difficult as I thought it was this playthrough. Um, ultimately, it's a great game. I love it. Um, it's a hard game to beat, but Mario Kart, Mario Kart has beaten it. Hands down. Although I think Mario Kart came first. Um, yeah. So 7 out of 10. Good game. Great party game. Great having friends over playing it. Um, story mode's great. Very competitive. Um, and it's a bit, it's just a little bit different rather than your standard racing game, it's a racing battle game, which is good. You also have planes, cars, and hovercraft, which is amazing. Um, but yeah, other than that, I hope you had a good one, enjoying this, uh, whatever I'm trying to say, if you did, uh, hit that like button down below. Uh, I'm tired, I'm gonna stop recording now. I think that's kind of started to show. Anyway, have a have a great one, guys, and I'll catch you tomorrow where we will be playing uh, Donald Duck Gone Quackers. But until then, guys, enjoy. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. If you want to check out the previous video for this series, click the top left video. If you want to check out my favorite videos from my own playlists, check out the bottom one where I've compiled them all together for you to check out. And if you're not subscribed, you can hit my logo up in the top right to subscribe. Again, thank you so much and I'll catch you next time.